Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. I have a huge, massive, huge Sephora haul. This is gonna be a long video, so get comfortable. I'm gonna dive right in. Uh, if you are unfamiliar, I have two babies under two years old and I am finding little pockets of time to make videos again and I'm really excited about it. I won't be editing this video, so I will try to make it interesting. And yeah, now I'm gonna dive right in. So the first, I, I ordered, like three batches of orders and I already tore into the first batches. So I'm just gonna show you what they are. I I turned this one into a little box for lipsticks I'm gonna be keeping. Oh, that's right. This is another thing I got. Okay, so um, I turned this into a little box for lipsticks, which I have more than that. But this is the Sephora Favorites Swipe Color. This one could be sold out, I don't know. Um, but this is a really, really great little set. This comes with a Summer Fridays lip balm. It, so it has, let's back up, it has three full-size products in it. And that's the Summer Fridays lip balm, the NARS, this one is the NARS Velvet Matte Lip Pencil, and I tried this and I really like this formula. I ended up getting another duo that they had available as, as a little uh, holiday gift set. These holiday gift sets are, I have a weakness for. I just really discovered them last year, so this year, last year I bought a couple of them, and this year I've gone a little nuts, and I just kind of see it as a present to myself for all the babies I just had, <laughs> all the babies, two babies I just had. Um, anyway, so, and then it has a Huda Beauty, yeah, Huda Beauty Lip Contour 2.0 Automatic Lip Pencil in Honey Beige. And then it has this, uh, these are two minis. This is the Clinique Black Honey. This one is apparently really, really super popular and coveted. And I do think that it is quite nice. It's the Almost Lipstick. And then here is a mini YSL Rouge Per Couture in 70, Le Nou. I gotta look, take a class on how to say French words. Um, so I got this. This is really great. I think this was $36 and it's something like a $96 value. Um, I bought the, I bought this one at the same, wait, I bought that one at the same time I bought this one and also this one and I bought these, I don't know, like, oh, I did make a video right before my son was born with an unboxing and try on that I hope to edit and make live at some point soon, but I really need to edit that video. Anyway, um, but my son was born like the next day and then just things were crazy with his birth. So anyway, I also got this. This is the Sephora Favorites Sparkly Clean Set, and it comes with the Tower 28 Balm, Ilia Limitless Lash Mascara, Mascara. No, this one's the fullest volumizing mascara. And this is a mini. This one's a full size. This one's a mini. And then the full size Merit Cream Blush. And this is in the color Cheeky. It's called a Flush Balm cheek color is what it's called. And then this from Say Beauty, which is gorgeous. I did put these into um, a site so that I could show you all these products. And then a Milk Makeup Chalk thing that's kind of weird. It's called the Color Chalk in Hopscotch. And then uh, the deluxe size of the Tatcha Silk Canvas. So this is the Liquid Silk Canvas and I did give this a try. It smells really good. I'm excited to continue to play with it. So yeah, so it has, this is the, the Milk product is full size, the Merrick product is full size, and the Tower 28 product is full size. I'm gonna show you uh, some of them. Here's the Tower 28 and this is a really lovely lip balm. It feels so good going on and it looks really, really pretty when you put it on too. Um, and then here is the Merit Cheek Balm is what they said they call it. And this is the shade. And here's the swatch. So I don't know if these sets that I'm showing you are still available. They're really good. I think that they're the best that, that were on um, the site. And then it also comes with... Um, oh, here's the Tatcha... Here's the Tatcha, and then I'm not quickly finding the others. The Say Beauty thing is really, really pretty. I wish I, I don't think I brought that. 
sorry. Okay, and then so you can see it's empty. I already played with it. But um, everything else that I bought, I do have intact. These are just my old orders that I didn't think I'd have time to talk about on my channel at all. So I didn't really keep them organized. But I do have the boxes I can show you. And then I also had gotten the Sephora Favorites Black Owned Beauty. And this one is really cool because they're donating a large percentage of the 15%, 15% to a nonprofit. The 15% pledge is a nonprofit advocacy organization urging major retailers to commit 15% of their purchasing power to black owned businesses. It offers large corporations accountability, support, and consulting services with the goal of advocating for and supporting black owned businesses. The 15% pledge seeks economic equality and prosperity for black futures founders, black students, and black people in the workforce. Launched in 2020 by Aurora James, the initiative was born from seeking multiple acts of social injustice and police brutality in the United States with a lack of accountability for the systemic issues at play. For more information, visit www15 percent that's the numbers 15 percent pledge.org. Super important. And I wanted to make sure to read that to everybody who watches this video. So this comes with a full size Pat McGrath lipstick in matte, the matte trance lipstick. And it comes with a sample of, I don't know how to say this, Adwoa, Ad, Adwoa <laughs> Beauty Balmint Deep Conditioning Treatment. And I did try this one out. And I, while I really, really like the way it works in my hair, it smelled a little like cough syrup, so I had trouble with that. Um, and then the bread uh, hair oil, and this is just called Everyday Gloss. This one smells really sweet, like candy. And then um, the Briogeo Don't Despair Repair Hair Mask, which I did not know that was a black owned business until I got this box. And I have used this one before, and to be honest, it didn't really impress me. It just kind of felt like any other conditioner. Um, but a lot of people really like that hair mask. And then a Shawnee Darden retinol reform serum. And I am excited to use retinol again, but I'm going to hang on to that until I'm done breastfeeding. And then a full size Fenty mascara, which is really cool. But I got to say, I used this and I was unimpressed. Unfortunately, it was a bummer. But, um, if you like like a subtle mascara look, I think you would like this. I have to try this again to see if it's buildable. If it's buildable, that might be another story. But if it kind of reminded me of the Great Lash Mascara from Maybelline. So if you like a subtle mascara, then you'd like this. But I couldn't get much volume or lengthening out of it when I tried it for the first time. But I do always say it's important to try things two or three times before you decide if you like them or don't like them. Um, speaking of mascara, I want to shout out to the one that I'm wearing right now. It's the Honest Beauty Mascara. I did not get this from Sephora. They're not at Sephora. Um, but it looks like this. And this I got in a Target mascara beauty box. Go search Target for the mascara beauty box. It's $14.99 and you get like seven products and almost all of them are full size. It is an amazing deal and if you're as obsessed with mascara as I am you'll be so happy so it comes with a primer on one side and then the mascara let me show you the spoolie too what kind of spoolie it is um, and then which I love this kind of a spoolie I love the spoolies in this one and I think that's part of why I thought it was so great and then excuse me yeah, I knew it. The blonde's on this side. <laughs> so, and then it comes with uh, the mascara on this side. So I was really impressed with this. I'm trying to get close so you can see what my eyelashes look like. This is one coat of the primer, one coat of the mascara. So I am very pleasantly surprised. I haven't tried much from Honest Beauty. Okay, so then, so that's that. And then I got the Fenty Beauty Rusting Peach Face Duo. So we're going to unbox this one right now. I really wish I wasn't wearing anything on my lips because I want to see what this 
peach looks like on my lips, but I will just go ahead and swatch it on my hand. This comes with the cream, a mini cream um, lip balm of uh, Rihanna's from Fenty Beauty. So this is it, and it's their pe a peachy color, and I think it was specifically made for this set. I don't know if it's available in general, but there's that. I saw a video recently, I don't remember who it was, um, it was somebody who had like a very peachy look going. They had like a peachy blush on and a peachy lip going on and like a gray eyeshadow and it just looked so good. Um, and then I saw this set shortly thereafter and of course I was like, oh, okay, I'm a tool and I'm gonna buy that. Um, so this is the cream blush that goes with it and I've heard really good things about this cream blush. I'm gonna run out of room for swatches fast. But so there's that, so they're kind of far apart. I should have done them right next to each other, but they match so well. So imagine how cute that would be. Okay, so there's those things. And then I got more blush, but they're minis. So I got the Rare Beauty um, Soft Pinch Blush Trio. And this is their minis, which this is, plenty of blush for me. I really am just going to play with this. I'm going to give one to my mom. Oh, I'd already picked which one. I don't remember which one it is of these. So this one also comes with like a peachy color and like a pinky color and more of a mauve color. And I'm really excited to um, try these out as well. Which one was I going to give my mom? I don't remember. Okay, I'll have to figure that out. So I got those. Um, if I swatch everything, this video is just going to be a million years long. I'm kind of crooked. Let's fix that. Oh, more crooked. Okay, there. Okay. Um, so I'm not gonna swatch these just because I realize I have so much to show you and I want to get through it before I can't film anymore because like a baby wakes up or a husband gets home or something. So I also bought the Tarte. I think I threw away the other box so it comes. Oh, and I put one aside for my mother because I'm gonna give one to my mother for Christmas. These are the Tarte Maracuja lip balms. These are crazy coveted. People were going for these so hard it went out of stock, but I think it's still available on Ulta. Ulta had it also. And it is very, very moisturizing, very nice. I gotta say, it didn't quite live up to the hype for me. To me, it's like a really, really nice moisturizing, like I just said, lip balm. And they are tinted and they have a fairly subtle tint. They're nice. Um, but the Sephora, do I have that one here? There's a Sephora lip balm that I also bought that's very similar and actually better, um, but they're all sold out. And I'm worried that maybe that means they're getting rid of the line. I'm not sure, but they were on super sale and sold out. So um, anyway, I feel like these are a little overhyped is the moral of that story. I feel like I'm trying to go fast and then in that I'm just saying things that I don't know, I'm just talking. So, and then I got the Bare Beautiful Minerals uh, Rescue Me set. I have been wanting to, and if you've been watching me, you probably know this, I've been wanting to figure out what kind of complexion products I can use that will work for me. I really don't like the way foundations sit. I don't like it. So I've been looking to tinted moisturizers and tinted serums and things like that. And this is a clean tinted moisturizer kit and it comes with, and you can customize it of course for your uh, color. This is the Complexion Rescue Tinted Hydrating Gel Cream and it has SPF 30. And this is really, well reviewed, has good reviews and highly recommended. And I am going to give this a try. When I did try it initially, it was kind of watery. So I'm gonna shake it a little bit and we're gonna see how it looks. Um, so that's how it looks. And I'm just gonna rub a little spot in here. So it looks like the color is good and it is a really light coverage. And it's supposed to be different, just different than foundation. So I am, Excited to try that out along with, this set also came with the Bare Minerals Mineral Veil. It's like a setting powder. And then the Bare Minerals Warmer, Warmth, Warmth is what it's called. So it's kind of like a brown, bronzer, bronzer, bronzer. It's a bronzer. And then it also came with 
a little lip gloss, a clear lip gloss of theirs, which I is like a bonus. I was more interested in this stuff because I just want to see, I want to find something that doesn't feel like foundation, but is still like a nice blurring product for my, you know, my dark spots and whatnot. Um, okay, so I got that and then I got, oh, we are just getting started. And then I got the Tatcha Dewy Skin, Dewy Cleanse and Hydrate set. Tatcha. I'm super excited to try some Tatcha stuff. And let's just take a look at this one. So these are minis and it's the Rice Wash and the dewy skin cream. So I'm excited. Tatcha. I've been wanting to try Tatcha for a long time. Okay, so that, oh, and then I also have gotten, this is the Pat, Mag Pat McGrath Lip Trio. It has a mini lipstick of hers, and this is the matte trance lipstick also, which I had a full size. There was a full size in this set of the matte trance lipstick. So had I realized, I mean, I haven't opened this, I could gift this, um, but had I realized that I might not have gotten this, but it also has a lip liner and a gloss to go with it, and it just all together looked really, really beautiful, and it had really good ratings, so this was one of the holiday sets as well, um, and then now, <laughs> now we're gonna go into this box, we haven't even touched this box yet, so for our wedding anniversary, I asked my husband to get me this Tatcha set. This is the No Filter Essential set, and I might do a video just about this set where I try it out. I am so excited. So along the spirit of what I, what the reason I got the, oh, my bra strap is showing, um, why I got the Bare Minerals set, I got this one because I want to find an alternative to foundation that's still a complexion makeup because... I like makeup a lot and I don't like the way foundation wears. Maybe, anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna try to stay focused here, focused. Um, so this has the silk canvas, the liquid silk canvas primer, the silk powder, the dewy, luminous dewy skin mist, and then the Kisu, Kisu, K-I-S-S-U lip mask. So super excited to try all of this stuff. It makes me feel so fancy and excited and excited. Okay. And then, oh, I so didn't need to get this. <laughs> this is the Sephora Favorites Lash Stash to go. So I have a problem with buying too many mascaras and too many lip products. I just told you about that Target kit that I got that has like seven mascaras in it. And I bought this and this is five mini mascaras. So there's that. Anyway, it has the Bite Beauty Mascara, the Milk Makeup Kush Mascara, the Huda Beauty Mini Legit Lashes Double Ended Volumizing and Lengthening Mascara. So that one's double ended. Oh, that's fun. Oh, that's fun. The Pat McGrath Labs Dark Star Mascara and the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. So I'm excited. I Now I'm back to being excited. I do need this. I love mascara. So I got this. Uh, my son's awake. Um, okay, I'm gonna have to go get him, I think. Yeah, he's crying. He's not going back to sleep for sure. Okay, I will be back. Okay, so I had mentioned that I also got some NARS, um, more NARS Velvet Matte Lip Pencils. I really liked the formula and they had these available. So I got these shades, Bad Girl and Do Me Baby. <laughs> ah, there was a time where I would have been amused by that, but now I'm like, oh heavens, <laughs> I've gotten so uptight. Okay, so <laughs> let's check out the colors. So these are the minis and here is this is Do Me Baby. Um, I won't be saying that again. Sorry, my hand's kind of wet. I washed my hands because I changed my son. There's Do Me Baby. That's a pretty color. Sucker for lip products. And this is Bad Girl. The coming through is kind of similar on the camera, it looks like, but they're different. This one is 
This bad girl one is kind of like a pinky brown and then the other one is more like a berry color. So there's those. I then got, you know, it's bad when you kind of forget what you got. I said this in my Ulta unboxing where it's like, if I forgot, I probably didn't really need to buy it, but I spent so much money. It's impossible for me to remember everything that I got. So then I got the uh, Sephora favorites. It's their their beauty box kind of deal. They do these regularly and they're $12 pretty much always. The Sephora favorites pop. I couldn't read it, it was blending in, but that's what it's called, the pop set. And this one has in it the Briogeo Don't Despair of Bear hair mask that I just mentioned that I'm not really a fan of. Maybe I'll throw one of them into a giveaway, um, but it's really, really well loved. Other people really like it. It has the Used to the People Super Berry Hydrate and Glow Dream Mask. So this is a little sampler size, but it's a good size, I think. It's half an ounce. So that's actually, that's actually a really good size. Um, so that's what it looks like. Pow. <laughs> pow. I say pow to my son a lot, and I just said it to you guys. <laughs> um, okay, and then it has the... Herbivore Aquarius Pore Purifying Clarity Cream. And then it has a very little Melt Ultra Matte Lipstick um, sample thing. Very, very little, teeny tiny. I don't even know. Oh my gosh. I thought it was going to be more like the deluxe sizes. This is like, wow, tiny. Wow, look at that color. I've been getting more and more bold with my lip colors too. Oh, it goes on a lot lighter than I thought it would. That's a beautiful color, beautiful purple. Oh, maybe I'll give this to my sister. My sister loves purple. Okay, so this is just gonna get lost if I sit on it funny. <laughs> I just talked about how I've become uptight. Okay, um, and then I got the, oh, and then it has the Juliet Has a Gun, Not a Perfume, Super Dose. Super Dose? Is that what that says? The font, I think that's the Super Dose. And let's smell this one. Oh, wow. Look at that size. It's kind of like a, is there a description? Let's see. Not good at describing. Okay. Intense version of the famous Not A Perfume. A mono ingredient molecular composition, clean, pure, unique. I was gonna say it's kind of a clean scent. Uh, yeah, that's how it's described. Clean, pure, unique. Hmm. There's something about it that reminds me of a hospital. <laughs> we'll see, I'll try it out and see what I think. But, And it's not a bad hospital smell, it's like that sterile smell anyway so that's a good size that's such a good size and then there's still more there's one more thing and this is the perfect strokes universal volumizing mascara from rare beauty i have heard really good things about that mascara and so this is what it looks like and so this is also really teeny tiny but uh so this was a really really good pop set i thought and i jumped on it Oh, I'm not a fan of spoolies like this. I don't like the bulky, bristly spoolies. It's just not my thing. I know that a lot of people really like those kinds of spoolies. I like the thinner, um, plasticky spoolies. Okay, so there's that one. And then what else is in here? I got, oh, these are my samplers. This is a good size sampler. We're gonna jump to this. This is the Fro the Rose Deep Hydration Face Cream. Isn't this is cute? And it is 0.23 ounces. You know, if new face cream you get is anywhere from one to two ounces. So this is a really good size for a little sampler. Oh, I'm excited. I've heard good things about this. I got this with my, oh no, this wasn't a sample. I think I got this with my points. So it's a little bigger than a sample. Okay, so that's different, but 
Oh, and then I also got with my points the TLC Sukari Baby Facial from Drunk Elephant. And I haven't tried anything from Drunk Elephant. Okay, now the last thing in here that I got is the Healthy Hair Must Haves Sephora Favorite Set. This one was $38 and $105 value. You know what? I also bought so much because they, they got me. They said, if you spend this much more, you're going to be rouge for the VIB sale. And I was like, oh, well, of course. <laughs> of course, Sephora. You are my master right now. So I went ahead and, and obeyed and spent that much more. 38 bucks. $38 for all of this. So what have we got? We have a Kerastase 8H Magic Night Serum, and this is just a uh, one time use, and I probably didn't say the name of that right. So, oh, and then here's another Kerastase, 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 um, something or other. This is the Elixir Ultime oil serum so much french uh <laughs> so yeah this is two of the same thing and it's oil i use more no i use about that much oil one one time i use a lot of hair oil because you guessed it i have a lot of hair um okay so those are two sampler type things and then we got some bigger stuff in here so at first it comes with the Olaplex number no. three bond repair. I have another one of these and I just, this is the hair perfector. This is the one that most people really, really love and recommend. I haven't um, used it yet. You apply it on damp, towel dried hair, a generous amount, leave on for a minimum of 10 minutes and then rinse. So you're supposed to wet your hair first. So I just haven't used it yet because you have to do more. Rinse from hair for best results, shampoo with Olaplex. Okay, you have to do more than I feel like I have time for. And then I was really excited because it comes with, I've been wanting to try Moroccan oil stuff. It comes with this Moroccan oil all-in-one leave-in conditioner. And then it comes with the Briogeo Scalp Revival, which I haven't tried this, Char Charcoal and Coconut Oil Micro Exfoliating Shampoo. So we'll see if I like that one. And then it comes with a Fable and Main Hair Oil. I haven't heard of this brand. I have to go to my son. There are just a couple more products and then I'm done unboxing. I have a few samples that I just won't show you, I guess. Then I got the Amika Flash Instant Shine Mask full size of course then i got the bb the bumble and bumble hairdressers invisible oil mask then it comes with the wow color wow dream coat super natural spray and this says it magically transforms tra magically transforms texture humidity proofing powers and then lastly i got a way hair oil so uh, that's it. That's everything in my Sephora haul. I'm going to go to my son now and I will, if you haven't subscribed, consider subscribing, like this video, subscribe, uh, say hello in the comments below, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.